I just think, fuck fitting in. Like, why? Why is fitting in the solution? So last week I was in London and I walked into a yoga class in Soho off Carnaby Street, a place called Tri Yoga. And uh, it's the first time I've been to that class. I haven't been to too many yoga uh, classes there. And I typically do hot power yoga here in my home, my hometown right now. Um, and so when I was in London, I walked into this class and I dressed the way I usually dress when I do hot power yoga, which is in like kind of a short bathing suit, small bathing suit, and that's it. And uh, so I walked in this yoga class and everybody's got like a lot more clothes than me, you know? Everybody's wearing a shirt, you know, guys and girls, and yoga pants and all sorts of uh, yoga gear, uh, a lot more covered up. So I was kind of like, well, don't really fit in here. That's kind of the first thing that jumped my mind, right? Like, I don't really fit in here. Um, and this theme of this idea of fitting in has been coming up recently in conversations. I was speaking with my group yesterday, one of my groups that I coach, a group of six, uh, entrepreneurs and um, we were talking about fitting in and actually feeling like you don't fit in in this group uh, and, and how that you know how if you feel like you don't fit in you're holding back you're not getting as much out of it da, 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 da. But, but the idea of like well how do you not feel you fit in we went around I went around and I had everybody share with, with the group how they feel like they don't fit in in this group and, and I've seen this done before and the way it's usually done is it's like Everybody shares how they feel like they don't fit in, how they somehow feel like they're an imposter in this group. Maybe they're not good enough or um, they haven't done enough or achieved enough. It could be a common thing. Or maybe it's the other side. Maybe it's like I'm kind of a badass and everybody in this group is kind of really not up to snuff or something. Whatever it is, you kind of feel like that you don't belong and you have this, they call it imposter syndrome. And... Um, and then what happens is when you talk about all the different you know, all the different people who feel like they don't fit in. Well, everybody feels like they don't fit in. And since we all feel like we don't fit in, then at least we can feel comfortable knowing that we all fit into that not fitting in. Now we can feel safe because everybody feels like they don't fit in here. And it's nice, but it doesn't really, it's a solution. It's inside this, this, this problem of like, how am I going to fit in? And I just think, fuck fitting in. Like, why? Why is fitting in the solution? Why, just because I want to fit in, should um, a, a, made, a way for you to be made to feel in um, be sought? And so I've been thinking about that, and you know, not just with, with coaching and stuff, but like every aspect of my life. Like, why, anytime I feel the need to fit in, why try to go to the end of that and figure it out? Like, what if I just didn't try to fit in? What if I just decided that I'm just going to be me and do what I do? And the world can either fit around me or not fit around me, and so be it. So be it. And so I'm going to show up in this yoga class wearing my short little bathing suit and nobody and nothing else and everybody else is going to be in their full you know, yoga gear. And I'm just doing what I'm doing and that's it. Full stop. You know, another way that another place I see this sometimes is in somebody talking about how um, I'm not oh, that, oh, that their conversation was boring. I don't really fit in in that group socially. And like my thinking around this, my approach would be just go into that conversation, go into that social group and just create what you want to create in there. Don't try to fit into their conversation. If you don't like that conversation, change it. Like speak about what you want to speak about. Ask the questions you want to ask. Create a world that fits into you. And this might sound a little bit egoic when you hear it like that. It's like, well, just if you don't, if you don't try to fit in, just go and create a situation where that fits into you. It might sound egoic, but actually, I don't think so. I think if you come from that place of, of ego and fear, it's different. But what I'm talking about is saying, forget being afraid of not fitting in and just live your truth. Just be you. And I think that if we go into an environment, into a context, and we just be who we are, we be expressed, we say whatever the fuck we want to say, we live from our truth, that actually the only thing that can result of that is more understanding, more integrity, more honesty, more connection and the creation of something that's more true and real. And, and as a result of that loving, you know, these things all overlap for me. If I'm going to speak my truth in every moment, I'm going to create conversation that, that changes. It's going to change what's happening. 
but it's going to be more true for me and that more true for me is going to create a more beautiful context it's going to create a more beautiful uh, dynamic so in summary we could say that by trying to fit in not only are you subjugating your truth are you not being who you are but you're creating a context or you're supporting a context that's incoherent with that truth, incoherent with the love, with uh, the passion, with, the, um, with, with what fires you up. And that is your gift. That's your gift to the world. Anytime you're trying to fit in, you're destroying the world because you're saying, I don't matter. I don't matter. So fuck fitting in. You know, I titled this video, How to Fit In Anywhere, but I just want you to click on it. I want you to click on it so you could give it up once and for all. And, and, and I'm asking you to do that once and for all. And I'm really looking at this lens and asking myself to do that once and for all. And to say, I don't give a fuck what people are wearing this yoga class. This is what I'm wearing or not wearing. This is what I'm doing here. This is what I want to talk about. This is what I want to create. This is who I want to be right here, right now. And if you fit in, great. If you fit into that, great. If you don't, that's okay too because I'm not going to not be who I am so that I can fit in with you. I'm not gonna live from that place of fear. Fitting in is all about fear. Much love. So if you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel, click the button, and also share with your friends, share the love, tweet it, Facebook it, Google Plus it, LinkedIn it, whatever you do, get it out there. And of course, if you really wanna engage in this idea, down below in the comments, the discussion, the dialogue is where the best insights come. Challenge me, ask me questions, I will get back to you. Your ideas, your comments help me to create more videos. Finally, if you're interested in learning at all about what I do, my personal coaching for leaders, artists, musicians, sole proprietors, anybody who's a creative force in the world and creating their own things, check out my website. Also, if you're a coach and you wanna learn more about my apprenticeship or learn more about how I create coaching clients, check out my website, link down below. Much love.